Kim Kardashian and Kanye West had a long history of romance until Kim filed for divorce, which was an official divorce. The divorce is still in progress and Kim has been reportedly linked with none other than Pete Davidson. When did Kim and Pete start dating? Was Kanye aware of their romance? How did the rapper react to the entire situation? Subscribe to our channel and keep watching this video until the end to find out the hot gossip. Kim and Kanye's complicated relationship. The couple has been together since 2014 and bears four kids together, which tells us why Kanye is upset about the entire relationship. The couple had always grabbed headlines for the wrong reasons. Everything turned into chaos in 2020 when Kanye announced that he was running for president. And also, it leaked information about his family. All this allegedly led Kim to be furious and if that was not enough, the rapper's songs claimed he had cheated on Kim. In the song Hurricane, the rapper mentioned how he had cheated on Kim after two kids. So when the president's controversy hit the roof, Kim had to come in defense of her husband. The reality star took to social media and said that Kanye is suffering from bipolar disorder. And anyone who has this or has a loved one in their lives knows how incredibly complicated and painful it is to understand. Sources claim that Kim was upset and angry that the rapper had publicly announced he had cheated. He should have thought of the kids before saying anything. It was the last straw for Kim and she filed for divorce in February 2021. Recently in June, Kim spoke about her complicated marriage and why she decided to divorce. In the series finale of Keeping Up With The Kardashians, which aired in two parts, she said about it in the first part. The reality star said Kanye deserves someone who can go support his every move and someone who can follow him all over the place and also go to Wyoming. Kim added she cannot do it and knows even her third marriage is a failure. But she does not want to think about that and wants to be happy. Then in the second part of the series finale, Kim spoke to Chris about the entire situation. The KKW Beauty founder said, I just feel like I have worked so hard in life to achieve everything I have wanted and I have to live up to my expectations and achieve 10 times more than it was humanly possible. When she turned 40, she realized that. No, she does not want a husband who lives in a completely different state. Kim wants someone who has the same shows in common, a person who wants to work out with her. Later, Kim revealed that it was Chloe and Tristan's relationship that opened her eyes, and the KKW founder said, every day Chloe, Tristan, and I would work out at 6 a.m., and I was third wheeling for eight months during the quarantine. Kardashian added, she can have all the extravagant things you can imagine, and no one will ever do it. She was grateful for those experiences, but now she wants to experience the smaller things, and that means more. Is this the reason she shifted her attention to the comedian? Keep watching the video to find out the relationship of Kim and Pete and how Kanye is angry with the situation. Pete wants a trophy wife. Pete is known to be in relationships with women that have uplifted his image. While Kim is already someone with more than 250 million is in no need for an upliftment. However, the comedian has always been dating famous people in entertainment. His first relationship was with Carly Aquilino back in 2015. Of course, it did not last for long, and Pete moved on to Casey David, which was followed by his relationship with Ariana Grande. Something fans noticed is that the young comedian's past relationships have never lasted for long. In 2018, rumors started to float around that he was not planning to marry Ariana. Sources claim that Pete was making extravagant demands, knowing the pop singer can afford it. Since the comedian is not as successful and lives in his mother's basement, conveniently broke up with Ariana when her ex passed away. Rumors of Pete and Kim started making rounds on social media when pictures of the duo went viral. Kim and Pete in the photo were holding hands on a roller coaster ride at Not Scary Farm in Buno Park, California. While sources claim that they hang in the same circle, so they will be seen together from time to time. Another insider said that they're just friends and nothing more. We all know how recently Kim hosted Saturday Night Live, where she openly poked fun at a marriage. And in one of the sketches, she played Princess Jasmine, and Pete was her Aladdin. During the sketch, the duo even shared a kiss. After watching the skit, one fan wrote, I cannot physically believe that Pete Davidson kissed Kim Kardashian. Another fan said that Pete Davidson kissing Kim Kardashian on live television was not on my 2021 bingo card. A source close to Pete revealed that he's interested in taking their friendship to the next level. When Kim had hosted the SNL, Pete was her biggest support. One insider said Pete was more supportive than anyone in the cast. When Kim hosted, Pete went out of his way to make sure she felt comfortable. Insider also said he even took time to privately coach Kim to make sure her jokes landed. 
What added fuel to the fire was their recent dinner date that the duo went on. Some fans claim that this was just another PR stunt to promote her latest show on Hulu. Reports claim that Pete had taken Kim to one of his favorite pizza places named Campania on Staten Island. One source close to Kim said that Pete can be super charming and Kim loves the attention. Kim is having fun and enjoying her life amid her divorce. Kanye West responds. The rapper had recently posted a cryptic video online, Thanksgiving, claiming he wants his wife and kids back. It was interesting to see how Kanye kept on calling Kim his wife throughout the video. Kanye might be praying to God that he wants his wife back, but the Kardashian is not in the mood. Kim's recent actions have revealed she wants to invest in a relationship with Pete. Even when the videos of Pete and Kim went online of kissing each other, the rapper was jealous. According to reports, he's not ranting or raging, but he found it embarrassing to see them kiss in front of him and the entire world, even if they were just acting. Fans are now trying to wonder how genuine Pete and Kim's relationship is. One fan commented, I think Pete Davidson is attractive, of course, but what is going on here? What made Kim Kardashian, out of all the people, go to Staten Island? Another one said these women are consistently using Pete Davidson to make their exes jealous. With the couple's recent PDA making rounds online, Kanye is reportedly put off by all the drama. He did not like the two of them being around in public together. Sources claim he asked Kim to please refrain from showing public displays of affection with anyone until their divorce is finalized. The rapper added, it does not look good for their family and does not look good for her in the eyes of God. Fans also noticed the hypocritical behavior of the rapper. Kanye has recently sparked rumors of a romance with the Russian model Irina Shayek. They were seen together and were quite happy as they celebrated Kanye's birthday. One fan said, not Kanye insisting that Kim is still his wife amid Pete Davidson dating rumors. Wasn't he with Irina Shayek two seconds after their divorce announcement? Another fan called out the rapper for blaming another when he's in the wrong in the first place. The tweet was, he cheated on her after they had kids. What is up with these men? You need to grow up and move on. They don't care about their women until another man has them. And this is not love. Also using God's name to defame a woman is so original. We will have to wait and see where Pete and Kim's romance goes next. Now we want to know what you think. Now do you know how the rapper reacted to the entire situation? Let us know in the comments below and until next time.